If you're like me, and I hope you're not, cause it's really quite difficult. You've wondered if they can have pig skins or pork skins or pork rinds or chicharrones, why can't they have the same with chicken? Chicken skin is so delicious. Why can't I go buy myself a sack of chicken skins that have been fried crispy and delicious? Well, guess what? You can. These products right here are something special. Actually, I know this one is. I haven't had these yet. I'm sure plain will be fine. A lot of times barbecue flavored stuff is too sweet for me. I just don't like sweet barbecue. I like heat. I don't like sweet heat. I like heat heat, but I like it just fine. These things are awesome. There's a bunch of different brands out there. I'm concerned about any kind of processed food. This isn't gonna be the healthiest thing in the world. And I have found healthy chicken skin online and man, is it expensive, but it is out there if you've got the money to buy some kind of fancy stuff. But as of right now, I'm occasionally gonna go to my new favorite gas station and pick me up a bag of these, probably these, but we're gonna taste test all three today. And I already know they're good. I'm just sharing them with you and I'm gonna tell you a little bit and show you a little bit about what the experience is like. What we've got here is something that I think is truly delicious. Now there are more than one brand of these, but these are the ones that happen to be available at one store in my area, one gas station that I know of has these. And so far, I've only had hot and spicy. As you see, we've got plain and barbecue along with the hot and spicy. And I want to introduce you guys to these delicious snacks. I'm going to start out with the plain ones. Like I said, I haven't had plain yet. You look down in there to let you see how this experience is. And I pull it out. It's all different shapes. As you can imagine, the chicken skin balling up like when you're eating regular chicken. Now, this doesn't have anything added to it except for things like a little bit of salt, a little bit of sugar. Still has almost no carbohydrates. And then some weird ingredients. I'm not even going to talk about it. This, this isn't great. The, the ingredients list is too long. And if you want the kind that has a short ingredient list, they're out there, but they're going to cost you a lot of money. But these are tasty if you ever see them going in mm. it says try it with hot sauce you could dip it in hot sauce that would definitely work i think you could dip it in anything not any not anything, but like a dip. But it tastes like a chicken skin. It tastes like, in my opinion, what you think it would taste like. If you've ever taken like a, a, a piece of chicken skin that was nice and crispy and pulled it off the chicken and ate it. Well, imagine it crispier than that. And imagine it, it's gotten cold and maybe it's had some processing done to it. But it's so good to me. These are so good. And plain, I like that better than I thought I would. I wouldn't hesitate to get plain now if they didn't have the hot, because I like it just plain. I love chicken skin. It's, it's so good. It's a lot less crunchy than pork skin. It's easier on your mouth, too. I don't know if you've ever done the thing. Of course you've done it. Where you eat pork rinds, or you eat or Cheetos, or puffy cereal, and it like tears up the inside of your mouth, tears up your gums, tears up the roof of your mouth. This isn't gonna happen with these, it's softer than that. It is crispy, but it's a lot softer as you can imagine just thinking about what chicken skin looks like. Let's get this barbecue flavor. This is the one I'm curious about. So let's try the barbecue flavor. That has so little barbecue flavor on it, I don't think I would know the difference between this and the plain one. It 
It says it's got some paprika, spices, chili powder, dehydrated onion. I taste almost nothing with these, which I guess is good because that means I can get these too. If they're out of any flavor, this is kind of interchangeable with the plain as far as my opinion, at least in this brand, Kim's. And now this is my favorite. You can almost see it's got a little, I believe you can see this one is a little redder than the plain. This has got some 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 real heat on it. Not Not terrible, but I mean, you can taste the heat. I actually wish the flavor of this was stronger. Because it's actual heat, you can feel a little bit of heat in your mouth. I'd rather have it hotter. Maybe I should dip it in hot sauce. Dip it in a little Texas Pete or one of those other ones. <laughs> I love that. I love that. And especially for people in keto, well, the heat hit me that time. Hmm. I love this. So yes, I 100% recommend it. If, if eating chicken skins sounds like something you would enjoy, then you will enjoy this. It's, oh, I love it. Every time I go in a gas station, I look to see if they have any of these. And if they do, I can't, I have to grab some. They're so good. I love them. Try them out. Thank you so much. I've been pretty slack on my Keto videos this year, and I know that, I apologize for it. I have been super busy. I've had a lot of things going on with my job. And the big thing is I went back to school and I actually finished my college degree. You are now looking at Keith Tube the college graduate. I have a bachelor's degree. Wish me for the best as far as whatever that's gonna lead to. And I'm gonna buckle down now and start getting these videos out at least once a week again. They're gonna keep coming now, so be ready. Watch your, Steve, stop it. Okay, thank you so much. See you next time. Heat, heat.